I've never really been the one who's worried Always been the one who's keeping it cool The kind of guy who chill while others hurry I didn't know that I've been the fool I've been telling lies about something real But I know love is Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Jenna. Do you want to say hi? hi. Come here. Oh, and this is Savannah. Say hi. 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 So Maverick just went down for his hi. last nap of the day. Hi. And <laughs> what we're going to do is we are going to get it all done pretty much. Hi. We are going to go ahead, clean up a bit. We are going to get dinner started. And Maybe yeah, huh? Play. Maybe. I watch the movie on TV. Okay. <laughs> so yes, we have a lot of things we got to do to get dinner going, to get everything on the way. Yeah. There's always stuff to do. As you see, this is a mess. Again, I say it in every single video. This is a mess. I have no idea what I'm gonna make for dinner. Yeah. Let me Hi. know in the comments down below what you're Hi. having for dinner because I have no Hi. idea yet. Hi, show me your arm. What is that? A cast. A cast. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead. Let's get this started, huh, Dan? See, let's go. Let's go. Woo! Captain Hook. Captain Hook. <laughs> You're silly. <laughs> Maverick takes three naps a day. They are all very short naps. Sometimes one will last a little bit longer than an hour, hour and a half, but this is the time that I usually get all of my ingredients out and I try to figure out what I'm going to make for dinner and I start prepping and I also start to clean up the house a little bit just so it's not like a huge wreck because if I don't clean up now that means I have to clean up right after the kids go down to bed and I did not want to do that this night. mentioned in Monday's video we are waiting for our new couches they should be here tomorrow we are so excited there have been maybe one or two times this week where we wish we really would have had them at that very moment but we have been keeping really busy with being outside going for walks doing activities with the kids and then also the project with the camper that's going on so we've been trying to keep busy so then we're not like, oh my gosh, we need our couches now. And we kind of did that on purpose, but we are so excited. We cannot wait for them to be here. It's going to look really nice. I cannot wait to show you guys our new furniture. We can make the sun come out.
anyone who is new here or if you are a new subscriber, I will just go ahead and tell you a little bit more about myself and my channel. My name is Jenna. I am a wife and a mom to two little Savannah and Maverick. Savannah is three years old and Maverick is going to be 10 months old here soon. We have three dogs and they're absolutely crazy, make everything chaotic, but we love them so much. On my channel, you will find tons of cleaning motivation, laundry motivation, DIY projects that I love to do with my husband, anything motherhood, lifestyle, the occasional vlogs, and anything and everything to do with our camper. I'm so excited. Lots of camper content is coming your way. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, I really hope that you will consider subscribing. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Would you stay till the morning light? Or would you follow me? Or would you let it be? If I leave tonight, we could do this right. We'll find the remedy. Or would you stay with me now till the morning light? Before you turn away, I just want you to know that I didn't throw your stuff away. Before you make up your mind that I'm nowhere to find I'm standing right here I know that I told you we're over I swear that I'm sober Just listen, I miss you And I know that I said all these things But now when you're with her I can see that, that you miss like make my own little version of it um as you see it's noodles hamburger and um i had the oregano it had um onion and like pasta sauce or whatever onion and garlic or something this is so a pound of hamburger and then i did a block of cream cheese just for like a little bit of extra um goodness and i will put more sauce in here not a lot but just a little bit more just so it's a little bit saucier um, and then I usually put mozzarella cheese, like shredded, but I don't have any. And so I did like Colby Jack just to make it like a little cheesier. Um, what I did last time what made it really good and like not so bland. Um, let me put a little bit of this sauce in there though. Cause, ah, if I can open it. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't open it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Maybe this will help. Okay. There we go. All right. Okay. Just a little bit more sauce. Smell good, Rudy? Does it smell good? Rudy's right here. I don't know if he's in the frame or not. Okay, so we've got this. I turned the heat down a little bit because my husband and I like it a little spicy. Um, obviously, the kids will not be eating this. Maverick has, um, I think he's gonna mac and cheese. Savannah's gonna have a hot dog tonight. That's what we do when stuff's like a little spicy. And yes, okay, so 
This is my new Kitchen Mama salt and pepper. Love using this. All you do is just turn it over and it comes right out. Look how nice that is. I didn't even press a button. You just tip it upside down and there it is. So what else I like to do is, um, it's just very, it's hot paprika, okay? I just put a little bit in there, just a hair, like just a little, cause it is super spicy, this hot paprika. Like, I mean, just a little bit, that is it because you will taste it all throughout. I mean, it is so good, you guys. So good. And I will add a little bit more um, Colby Jack cheese. Might put a little bit of Parmesan in there to make it just a little bit cheesier because it's not too cheesy right now. The sauce is perfect. So let's go ahead. I'm going to go grab, I'm going to grab some Colby Jack and oh, it's all over the sauce. I'm such a messy cook. Okay, let me get Colby Jack. Oh my gosh, the Colby Jack's right freaking here. Okay, so we're going to put... Like I said, it's not much, but we just like it. We just like our stuff cheesy. I do have this cheddar I might put in, just a hair, um, just a little bit, yeah, just to make it cheesy. That's it. We don't really, we don't really need a lot. Yeah. See, we like ours really cheesy. I have it on one because my husband's not gonna be home for a half hour. Zach isn't. I don't know. Why I keep saying my husband. You guys know who Zach is. You know him. You guys know. You know who he is. All right, yeah, I think I'm gonna add a little bit more cheddar. And then, oh, I think it's gonna be good. We'll just let it sit, look at that. It's gonna melt, looks so good. Needs a little bit more flavor though. And if I need to, I'll add just a pinch of hot paprika in there. But I pretty much just made this up. <laughs> um, it's really good. I was like, you know what, this is all the stuff that I have, so let's just mix it all together. If you guys want to try it, let me know in the comments below if you want to try it, or if you do try it, and let me know what you think. Like I said, I literally made this up. You can put whatever else you want in it, in it. Whatever you want. I'm sure you guys are wondering why my dog Cash over there, and Cash is a full Pembroke Welsh Corgi, you guys. I've had a couple of people ask what breed he is. He is a full Pembroke Welsh Corgi. If you don't know, Corgis can be like the red color what Junior is, and then they can also be the tri-black color. So he is a full-bred Pembroke Welsh Corgi. Anyways, you're probably wondering what he's doing over there, and there's either two things. Actually, I know these two things are going on. The cats are probably playing and making a noise in the garage or meowing, and he does this every single day. He will go over there because he knows that my husband, Zach, is going to be coming home from work and he comes through the garage. So he just knows he's going to be home. So he just goes and lays right by the door until he gets home. I swear dogs can just like sense these things or they're just like so in sync with your schedule. You know what I mean? Like they just, they just know. Let me know in the comments down below if you like, if you know that's a thing <laughs> or if you have dogs and like you think that's what's going on too. I'd be very curious to know what you guys think. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control. You push me, then you pull me back in. Don't know if I can decipher how your mind works Yeah, you leave me wondering what it's like to feel your skin I will keep on trying till You give me a sign Give me a sign Ah, oh, give me a sign Baby, give me a sign Just give me one more You leave me hanging, begging for more Think that I'm addicted to this, can't resist to be a little risky and go for it Cause I want you close, I'm so exposed when you're keeping me wondering You know I'd do anything to be in your arms again So give me a sign, give me a sign Oh, give me a sign, baby give me a sign me one more talking to you here we go again staying up all night to see if you've been texting me where do we go from here i want to go all in so give me a sign now that my
my husband Zach is home, we love to eat dinner as a family together. Like that is our favorite thing. Now Savannah's iPad is there because we turned it on right after we got done eating just so she would be kind of entertained and patiently waiting because we were going to play outside afterwards, which you guys will end up seeing. But like I was saying, we absolutely love and really try to eat dinner as a family at the table. I grew up that way and I just really want that to be like instilled in my family. I just want to eat dinner together, talk about our days, see each other. I just find it very important for all of us to just eat dinner together and I just want to get that as a really good habit for us to do that while the kids are young so then they will really look forward to it and cherish it as they get older because I know sometimes when I was growing up I was like oh I gotta eat dinner but I actually really enjoyed it. I love being able to spend time with my parents and my brother around dinner time just because you know, we were all so crazy busy and life was just so chaotic. So I really enjoyed that and I really hope as my kids grow up, they will really enjoy that too. I just want to let you know I could go for this no more trip. Someone's up from his nap. Hi, bud. Oh, is daddy home? Hi, Mav. Hi. So Maverick's going to eat. Yes, I will help you put on your pants. Savannah went to the bathroom upstairs. You got my clothes yeah. baskets. Flip loads laundry, feed Maverick, and then we're going to enjoy some hey. outdoor fun, right? Yes. We could take things slow. Say you think about it too. When the lights go out and there's no doubt that I should be with. That I should be. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control You push me, then you pull me back in mm -mm -mm. We've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going, no control You push me, then you pull me back in So give me a sign Give me a sign Baby, just give me a sign just give me one more talking to you and here we go again staying up all night to see if you've been texting me where do we go from here i want to go all in so give me a sign Traffic lights And I I really wanna know Really wanna know If I Okay, I am so excited Yes, another Amazon package But my phone case You guys, I recorded my phone so you can't see My phone case Is a disaster Like, it is an absolute disaster so, oh my gosh, I can't even open this. So I have my phone case in here and I'm gonna show you guys. I have just like a basic, basic, basic black phone case. Well, I want this open. I want it because we're about to go. <laughs> we're about, oh my God, he looks so cute in those jeans. We are about to go for a walk. Can we go for a walk? Um, so yeah, here, uh, yes, I have the iPhone 11 Pro Max and it comes with screen protectors too, I think, which is nice because I, no, it doesn't. I'm just kidding. It doesn't. For some reason, I don't know why I thought it did. But I got my new black phone case. Like, I'm going to show you guys the difference really quick. Just hold on. So here's the inside. Obviously, this is the old one. This is the new one. And then I got the new one because look at that. It was like, look at that. So broke. Terrible. And down here broke and yeah, I mean, it's a nice phone case. I've had it for a while. I'm just really rough on phones and I can't have a bulky one with my tripod since I recorded my phone. So yeah, fun things. Oh, I guess I should show you that pan. I could show you that pan like when we get back um, from walking. We're gonna go walk with the wonderful wagon you guys will see. So let's go for a walk. Let me figure out where the road goes. Even 
And if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Nian, where are we going? What kind are you getting? Cool. We are waiting in line to get ice cream. So exciting. What? I know, babe. And then Maverick back there, he's going to have ice cream for the first time. Just a little bit. What are you going to get, babe? I'm not sure. I think I'm gonna get a McFlurry, like, but not from. They're like, called avalanches. Here. Avalanches here, not a McFlurry. That's only McDonald's. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I got my ice cream. I got a. They call it like an Oreo tornado. That's what Zach got. Savannah's strawberry malt, but really, uh, her ice cream, strawberry ice cream, is in there. And um, Maverick's probably gonna end up trying hers, not ours, just because of all the chocolate and stuff. So yeah, we are on our way home to go do that. Yes, we're not eating yours, honey. <laughs> so yummy. No, you got your own. Okay, ready? Maverick. No. Maverick, ready? First bite of ice cream. It's cold. <laughs> oh my god. Mommy, I love cold ice cream. You like cold ice cream? Maverick did not know what to think of it. I love it. Like I it. love it. You love it? I love it. Right? You love yours, Daddy? Yes, do. Mommy, I love my sandwich. All right, Daddy, you feed him now. No, my sandwich. It's so good. You like it, Mavi? That's a big bite for him, honey. He's probably going to get a brain freeze. <laughs> he likes it. From cliffs so high Trust in our wings to fly Sometimes we cry I love the Dawn Power Wash product that I use for this pan. I use it for a lot of things. As you saw, there is still a little bit of residue left, but it seriously does a fantastic job. It does so much better than just like letting it soak and putting soap in there. It does a great job. I highly recommend it. It's a little pricey, but it does a great job. I am very impressed. A lot of people use it for a lot of different items and products around their house, and I've used it on my microwave and it works great, so I really recommend it. And if you have tried it before, let me know in the comments down below what you thought about it and if you really liked it or loved it and what you used it on. Down, but we get up and start from the ground. And I, I really wanna know, really wanna know. Alright, you guys, and that is going to be it for today's video. I really hope there's Maverick down there. Playing with daddy's cooler from work. Maverick! Hey! Maverick. Okay, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure to like and subscribe. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to become part of my YouTube family. Really hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Bye. I've never really been the one who's worried. Always been the one who's keeping it cool.